I'm Richard Prum. I'm the William Robertson Co. Professor of Ornithology at Yale University. And I'm the author of The Evolution of Beauty. So one of the things that's really mysterious about people is the evolution of our cognitive complexity, our long childhoods, language, material culture, all of these things. And they take large amounts of investment in babies to get them to grow for a really long time. This pattern of investment was only made possible by overcoming male violence in our primate ancestors. Male chimpanzees and gorillas uh, routinely murder babies for their own sexual advantage when they take over the troop. And this kind of infanticide is really damaging to the sexual interests of the females. So one of the things that had to happen in e human evolution was to solve the infanticide problem. Human females have evolved uh, or have uh, used mate choice to transform maleness in a way that furthers their own sexual autonomy. Uh, and this could have included preferring uh, males that were smaller in relative body size, that is not as large as say gorillas, that had smaller uh, canine teeth, they didn't have weapons in their faces like our chimpanzee ancestors. So this is a kind of special way in which mate choice can remodel maleness in a way that furthers the sexual autonomy of the female.